And Des Kelly. Thanks very much, Gary. James, what a night, what a result after a pretty nerve-wracking first half, has to be said. Yeah, it was. Um, you know, they're a good team. They're always going to put you under pressure. We knew that. Um, you know, we couldn't get out. We needed to be higher and put a bit more pressure on them. If you give good players time on the ball, they're going to hurt you. And uh, they had chances, but, you know, I think that shows a lot how we came out second half and went again and, and put in that performance and got the result. Mo, you were the calm in the, in the storm there. That goal pretty much sealed it for you. Yeah, I think the, the goal was in, in time for us because the, they were pressing very high and they had many chances. So in the beginning, we struggled a little bit because they scored in the first two minutes. So after that, we we come back, we, we played hard and uh, we get the result. That's the most important thing. Were you a little bit surprised by their for formation? Did that catch you out? I changed my position many times, but, you know, in the end, we play for the, as a team. We play 11 players, everyone gave 100%. So we are happy about the result. Had to keep your nerve, as I said at the top, that worst possible start, one minute, 57 seconds to get the crowd going here. Yeah, in a way, maybe it woke us up as well, you know, that early. And, um, you know, I think, like I say, that says a lot about the boys to, to come under that pressure first half and, and at the end of the second game as well, really, and to go one down early on, um, you know, got the crowd up. Like I say, they're a good team, they're always going to have chances, but, you know, second half, we got hold of it slightly more. Um, you know, we still have to improve and we, we need to learn from from the tie, but I think um, everyone knows how good Man City are to, so to beat them over uh, both games is, is, is a good confidence builder for us, shows we're a good team, but again, there's a lot that we can learn from these two games as well. Bit of a lucky break in the first half, it looked like that Leroy Sane goal was a legitimate goal, but what was, what was the message at half-time then? We obviously wanted to improve, like I say, we, we didn't get high enough, so we couldn't get the pressure on them, and, and that's as a team, everyone together, so we needed to do that, I thought we got about them a bit more second half. Um, you know, kept the ball slightly better and a bit more composed at times, but we defended well again, and that's the key and what you're always going to have to do um, against these sorts of teams. I mean, you've got guys like him up front, it obviously helps. You're enjoying that, Mo. The fans are enjoying it as much as you. It's a big, it's a big statement, isn't it, for Liverpool? A big statement for Liverpool into the last four for the first time in 10 years. Yeah, it's a good song. I like it, but, you know, in the end, I said many times, well, I play for the team, I try to score each game for, so, to help the team to get a point, to, to win a game. So that's the most important thing for me. Congratulations, gentlemen. Thanks, Thanks for your time. Mo Salah, it's a good song. Yeah, deserves a good song. Great player. What a season he's having, isn't he?